Hey there, welcome to Golf Beginner World. I want to check with you today if you're repairing your pitch marks correctly. Now I'm sure you're doing it fine, but I know a lot of golfers uh, who don't really repair the damage at all. What they do is they stick their pitchfork correctly into the ground, diagonally into the ground, but then they lift up the soil and the grass. And what happens, because the soil is being lifted up, there's this horrible white or darkish, depending on the, on, on the soil, mark that can be seen for over a week. So they haven't really done anything good for the green, and that's going to take really over a week to repair. So what is the right thing to do? How do you correctly repair a pitch mark? The first thing you need to know is from which direction the ball flew. So there's the tee box and the ball flew in this direction. So the ground was pushed in this direction. So that's from the back side. I stick my pitchfork into the ground and I push that ground back towards the hole. Okay, from, and then from the sides. So this doesn't really look like much at first, but if you use your putter to pat it all down, you'll probably see that it looks just as good as, as new. Um, and the green keeper will be very happy that you've done it that way, because if you forget to repair your pitch marks or you do it incorrectly, as I showed, Really, that's going to take uh, over a week to repair. So, thanks for watching. Hope that was useful information for you. See you soon.